Hey Marcel, you think the the game you had against Texas really prepared you at top of the you know of the D line? Um, in a way, yeah. I mean, they they year we won the national championship, and I feel like I played pretty hard that whole year. But that game really put me up there. Well, okay, he made a name. He made a name for himself. He made he left a mark in college, you know. And people recognized that and, and saw that and saw my other attributes that I brought to the game, and that kind of prepared me where I am now. What have you learned from a coach like Nick Saban? I learned a lot from um, Coach Saban. He taught he taught a lot of things. The little things, the little things that matter, like run, finishing through the line, um, finishing up on your reps, follow through with your hands, and it, it's the little things. Follow through on your stunts and watching film, studying offensive linemen from a point of attack with handing like the hit with. There's a lot of things he taught me along the way and just the things that I've already um, had in my arsenal, he just brought more things to it. So it was a good combination. He taught me, taught us, a whole, taught us all a whole lot. You been uh, playing in the 3-4 at Alabama, what would be the biggest adjustment for you if drafted by a team that runs a 4-3 defense? It'd be a good advantage for me because I'm used to it. I've been running it for a little while and um, I'm pretty, I think I'm pretty good at it. And I'm pretty good at either position. Tilt, two eye, three, five, six, seven, nine, it don't matter. <laughs> a year ago in the championship game, when you mentioned to your teammates that you're looking at the MVP right here, what enabled you to, to have such a successful championship game like that and actually be the MVP? Um, through the whole week preparing for the game, I was telling all the players, I was like, man, y'all looking at 